Hello everyone. The topic for this week's lab is buckling of columns. This second section of the lab requires the use of a high capacity universal testing machine and as such, this would be conducted by a qualified technician. Nevertheless, it is important to understand the procedure. To begin, record the actual cross-sectional properties of the hollow structural selection, or HSS. Then measure and record the column lengths between pins, the points of rotation. The column specimen will then be placed and aligned in the test apparatus and the testing machine. Now, loading will be applied continuously until the column buckles. Record the buckling load for the column specimen and record this value in Table 3. Finally, the procedure is repeated for all five column specimens.
The test results from this section of the lab will all be provided to you. Results for a 200mm stub column will also be given to you, but in the form of a stress strain curve. With that, Lab 11, Buckling of Columns is completed. You will now proceed to complete the problems and exercises in your lab manual using the given data. Good luck with the rest of the lab.